quad walks. These are extremely difficult. You're gonna get yourself up into a quadruped position, which means that you're on all fours and then you press up onto your toe or lift yourself up off of your knees so that the weight goes from knees and toes then just into your toes. And all you're gonna do from there is you're gonna walk forward, walk back. So you're gonna do like left arm, right leg, right arm, left leg, and then you're just gonna walk it back the same way that you came. And you're just gonna wanna make sure that you kind of alternate which arm and leg is like going forward. You can switch every time, or you can do like half going forward with the right arm, finish that one out, then half going forward with the left arm. I don't care how you do it, just make sure that you switch it up a little bit. Or if it's easier for you to step forward, like right arm, left arm, and then come back, I really don't care. Just keep your core engaged. Everything is very strong. Make sure that your knees are not really high up in the air either. I want you to stay low. The more parallel your spine is with the ground on this one, the more benefit you're gonna get. I could have said the harder it's gonna be, but we're gonna think about the benefit that we're getting from this. So you lift your knees just a little bit up off the ground, and then you take those really small steps. Oops, I just messed that up. So you step, step, and then come back. Again, just think about your core staying strong. It is very hard. If it irritates your hands, just go onto your fists and keep your wrists straight the entire time.